All right, July 2nd at White River Campground in Mount Rainier National Park. The first outing for Bigfoot Overland since we've got this Tupui Grand Sabana on. Um, there you see we've got a 28 watt solar panel that's uh, putting some charge to our Goal Zero Yeti 150 up there. Um, it's not going to charge the thing quickly, but it is putting some back. Overlandsolar.com, where we got this 28 watt panel uh, in 2015 at the Northwest Overland Rally in Plain, Washington. Here we go around the back of uh, the Forerunner. There we got this better built drawer here. It is not secured in there but then we've got I'll show you the the black cases that we can put up there in the cooler if we've got the seats up so there we go just portable ham radio extension cords for the inverter we got up there umbrellas a few tools hearing protection for if we're out somewhere where we can do some target shooting and things like that That, uh, there's a little aluminum table right there that we don't have out right now because we don't really need that out at the moment and we've been putting the goal zero right here and then plug it in and it's getting a charge while we're on the road uh, here we did not bring the annex on this trip we didn't think we needed it's just Rita and I uh, so we don't have the annex here on this trip for the for the tent and here you see a little triple a battery powered uh, motion detector light LED light and that thing um, last night you know if anything's happening out here or we're gonna go to the ladder or anything like that that'll pop on stay on for about 30 seconds until there's no movement but there's our little motion detector security system there. Take a look up in the tent here. We've got a couple of lights on right now. Uh, the little string light there above the window. I think that was about five bucks on Amazon. It's got a uh, sticky to it on the back that if you wanted to mount it on something, but we're just testing out how we like that. We may get some more of those and and mount them with velcro or something on some of the posts in here there's another light up here um, so right now you see the goal zero has both of those powering off of the USB the blue light that you see on the goal zero right there means it is getting some charge from that solar panel outside uh, so for just the two of us last night our first time out with this very happy step comfortably and we'll move back down here here we see a couple of the black cases there that we use one is usually stuffed with food paper towels paper plates that kind of thing um, the other case over here will be stuffed with propane and batteries uh, the lanterns, things like that. Uh, what else have we got out here? The thermocell right there. We swear by those. Um, always does a good job keeping bugs away. There's our Coleman lantern. We've got a little drawer right there that we keep cutting boards, cups, you know, utensils, that kind of stuff in. We've got just one water cube with us this weekend because there is water here at the campground. This is our first time here at White River Campground, and then this new stove. We were going with two burners. Um, now we've got this one that's got one burner and a grill over there, and we got uh, some grilling mats to cut down the fit on that, and we'll see how that does. Cook up some tri-tip tonight, some burgers or some French toast on there, something like that. All right, so there you go. There's the, the look around, the Bigfoot Overland, 
campsite for our 4th of July weekend.